Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, KRT Life, Life with the Y. Please like, subscribe, comment, all those things, it really helps. And thank you for all of you guys who are actually supporting us because I know a lot of people comment and get involved into conversations with that, which is awesome. So today's video is going to be on our very favorite water solution. Storage solution. Water storage solution, I couldn't come up with the word. So yes, the best water storage solution for us after we tested out a few things. So yeah, check it out. So we decided to start doing little reviews on the products we use because we've been camping for quite a few times now. So we know what we like and what we don't like, certain things we use and certain things we return and we just kind of think it's just not a good spend of money. One of the things we want to talk about is these water bottles that we use. So we started using as jerry can and Reza had this whole idea of how to modify it to have a hose attached. So, and it was good, but the size of the jerry can and the shape of it was so awkward for us to put in the truck that it was kind of hard to puzzle it in with the rest of the things that we were putting in the truck. So as always, we do a very heavy research. As soon as we came back from that seven day camping trip, if you guys haven't seen it, I'll post one of the links up here to one of the days from the camping trip. But anyway, once we came back from those seven days, Reza goes, okay, we're gonna return this jerry can. This isn't going to work. And he started doing some heavy research on these water systems that people carry with them. Because we try to minimize things, we don't really wanna put anything major, but we needed something that is light, foldable maybe, easy to use for what we need. And he found this awesome company that is manufacturing these water bottles. They have multiple sizes. They have anything from very little. I don't have one with me, but it's gonna be right here overlaid so you guys can see it. And we have two of those. And we also got three of, what size is it? Two and a half or 2.6 gallons. gallons. Yeah, yeah, something yeah, something like this. So total we can carry almost 10 gallons of water. So let me show you how it looks. We have one half full and we have one still full one because we just haven't used it yet. So let me show you. All right, so let me see what this company's called. It's called Smart Bottle. I couldn't remember their name. But anyway, so it looks like this. This is full, full, full. It looks like a cube when you fill it up. And the attachment on it, they have two different attachments that this is like a little spout that you can, you know, adjust how much of a water flow you want. Or they have another attachment that you put on here if you want to attach the actual hose. And I'm telling you, these spouts are awesome. Like, they're great. Plastic comes with all these holes and then super heavy duty plastic. So you can actually hang it if you want to even upside down like this and use it so this is what it looks like when it's full well let me show you one that we actually use today and you see it's sitting inside of our porch so this thing haven't been leaking and it's been here for what two days in a row at this point yep down really bumpy roads down a really bumpy roads because we are camping completely off grid this time so let me see i think the other one is sitting on the rock all right, so this is the one. So this is, yeah, the size of this is like almost three gallons. This is the one that we've been using for the last two days almost. I haven't used that much water, but this is what it looks like. It's literally just empties out slowly and then just gets flatter, but it's still very convenient too. So this is what it looks like if you open it up. You can do a very slow one or you can like open it up and properly, you know, get this water out if you need to i think these are the best from everything we have tried they super light <laughs> he has his baby over there <laughs> these are super light they fold they fold completely flat when you know you're not using them so they don't take any room in your car or truck or whatever if you just finish them up versus a full jerry can i think it's great if you can mount it on the side of the truck can you bring a jerry can over here mitch 
<laughs> Jerry cans, I think, great. If you have room either on the rooftop, like on the roof rack, or if you can mount them outside somehow, they, they don't take space. But our GX or Porsche does not allow that at the moment. So this, I think, is the best solution for us. And these are not that expensive. I think these were what? $13 each. $13 for this whole thing. And it's amazing. And then destruction test. Yes, that's what I was gonna say. We watched this couple of videos where these people try to destruct them, and oh my god, like they damn near impossible. They drag them on the ground, on the dirt roads. They throw them off the like, um, the, you know, high rocks and stuff. They rode in the four wheeler like over that thing. Even the truck rode over one, and they damn near impossible to destroy. Like to destroy. So this is like a typical jerry can. This is the one that we had as well. Our brother Mitch still has one because he have capability of mounted on the outside of his truck, which is awesome. But for us to be inside a GX, it wasn't working for the shape of it because we have these certain boxes that we fit in and we kind of puzzle everything in really tightly and this wouldn't let us do it properly. So I think it has a spout that attaches to the bottom of this. Yep and which is good but yeah. it's uh, requires some doing yes and the spout that comes with it doesn't really work very good we try to open it unscrews itself and you have a problem with the top of this right here sealing it doesn't seal very good yes yeah, so this is a good option but i don't think it's the best option for us yeah and then we have this so msr a, system which is you want to talk about it Go for well so this is a 10 liter we kind of tested it we didn't really I don't feel like we tested it enough maybe, but this is supposed to be super heavy duty, very durable. You can hang this up and have yourself a shower or whatever that can be. This thing has a little spout. Let me try to open this. Let's see. It just pops up. Yeah. yeah. There it goes. So you can do that, but you know, so here's the thing. This is, I think, great, but if you try to cook or you need like a heavy flow of water, this isn't going to work this probably going to work better so i think at the end of the day it's what are you using for what kind of you know vehicle you have and what are your preferences are this is going to be a first time we are going to do a giveaway because we use these products so much and we love them so much we want everybody else benefit or test them out we're going to do the giveaway on one of these this is almost a three liter one and we're not even sponsored by them either yeah, well, this is not a sponsored video, you guys. This is just from us. In order for you to enter into the giveaway program, uh, we're going to need you to subscribe and comment below. First 50 people with comments and subscriptions will be entered in the giveaway. Unfortunately, it has to be into, within United States territories because we cannot ship overseas at the moment. But once we pick a winner out of the first 50 comments, we're going to contact you through the comment and then we can figure out the details. Yep. So if you are interested in getting one of these and testing it out, or if you're a camper and you want to use one of these, go ahead, subscribe, go ahead, comment, and good luck. Can you tell them real quick the price differences between all three of these? I think that's the biggest wow factor. Okay. Oh, the price. So I know price for these are within 14 15 it's like 13 15 dollars yes. price of this was almost 50 bucks it was like almost 60 it was like almost 60 dollars these came through amazon correct yeah. and, and the msr 10 liter msr 10 liter how much how is the much msr is? how much is msr yeah 50 i thought it was like 80 when i looked we're gonna put it in the comments right so, here yes, i'm gonna go ahead and just Put it right here on the bottom just to make we're sure off we have grid it. so we can't just pull it up right now yes i am going to put it in there <laughs> <laughs> and so yes for the price range i think this is definitely a winner for us yes so definitely check this company out because i mean this thing is awesome we use it on every trip and it gives us a lot of versatility uh let me see if i can this adjust this real smart quick. bottle smart bottle incorporated.com made in the usa right in i think south of north carolina because they were really close to us when we um when i contacted them yes but these people are amazing yes all right y'all KRT life KRT life and wildlife subscribe comment we out peace all right so one thing i forgot to mention 
I know some people that care about the way their gear looks and for me personally I needed yeah I needed to look good but it has to be functional so as far as the look goes this is definitely not going to be a winner for sure <laughs> nothing tactical about that nothing tactical about that it's just it's very useful very convenient but definitely not fashionable it looks like a what you call it bag an IV bag it does look like IV bag that is 100% <laughs> sure so this Jerrycans, I think they look cool. Like, especially if you get like a nice jerrycan mounted on the side of the truck, it definitely looks dope. This thing, I like the way this looks. Yeah, that looks dope. Yes, the uh, MSR definitely looks great. But functionality is questionable. Yes. <laughs>